Hey everyone, so I wanted to start like a quick little series called, uh, you know, Fusion 360 Quick Tip or VCarve Pro Quick Tip or even Easel uh, Quick Tip and just kind of sharing uh, little things that I may have learned uh, going through a project or something that I think is uh, pretty neat. So um, in this first episode of, of Fusion 360 Quick Tip, I just want to go over um, a tolerance setting that you may have not have thought about for your CNC router. See, Fusion 360 is inherently built and made for machining metal. Well, when we're trying to machine wood, wood, we can't get the accuracy as a like a vertical milling uh, station or or something like that. So our machines are are a lot less rigid, um, at least unless you get into hundred thousand dollar machines, but. Uh, so one thing to think about is the tolerance that a CNC router will will machine at. And when you go in here into your cam environment and you double click on one of your operations, you can go over here to the passes tab. And the first little thing is a, is a tolerance. See like this one is set at four thousandths. And this next operation uh, is set at, at four tenths. Um, so you know a CNC router um, you know a decent CNC router we can get down to the thousandths range um, something like the X car you may want to bump it up to ten thousandths or so so what we can do is we can go in here and we can change this to let's say five thousandths and we'll have that machine tolerance and we can come down here to smoothing and also put that in as five thousandths what that does is it allows the machine instead of calculating a bunch of little tiny points on on say this arc right here it's calculating a bunch of tiny little points because it's trying to be real real precise it'll smooth that out a little bit and and your tolerance will will go up so it it won't have as much um, computing that it needs to do when the information gets sent to either your smooth stepper uh, your USB stepper or whatever you're using to control your CNC machine so by setting this tolerance and it can be as much as as ten thousands um, but that you know or, or more depending on the job but uh, that will be a way to help the machine uh, run better and faster and smoother and you might see kind of significant difference uh, with that uh, in the way that your machine runs so I just wanted to share that real quick. Uh, let me know if you got any questions or comments uh, and put those down in the comments below and, and don't forget to subscribe.